in the first week of August, which means it's World Breastfeeding Awareness Week. Clayton Castle has the story on how local employers are aiming to combat the stigma around breastfeeding in the workplace. It's World Breastfeeding Awareness Week around the globe. According to health officials, it's a week to make the public aware of the benefits of breastfeeding for newborn babies. Just, it's the perfect thing. It has all the, um, you know, the antibodies that the baby needs to fight off infection. Um, you know, it's got the exact amount that the baby needs. So as the baby starts out at a young age, it has a small amount of breast milk and that's all their belly needs. And they have decreased risk of illness as far as gastroenteritis, ear infections, respiratory infections, um, decreased risk of SIDS long term. Breastfeeding also has benefits for the mother as well. For women um, and moms, you know, they have decreased risk of osteoporosis, decreased risk of ovarian cancer, breast cancers. Um, they heal from childbirth a lot quicker as well. Now, breastfeeding has been around for ages, but there's still a stigma in society about breastfeeding in public and in the workplace, a stigma that Essential Health is trying to eliminate. You know, we really encourage that they can breastfeed anywhere, you know, reminding them that um, they don't have to hide in a um, changing room or in a bathroom or in their cars, they can breastfeed anywhere they want. Employers around the area are also combating the stigma, including CTC in Baxter, which has a wellness room that allows employees to breastfeed in a private setting. To make sure that they have accommodations for young mothers coming back to work. Tennis says there are benefits to having wellness rooms for mother, baby, and employer. It makes it easier for them to come back. Um, we want to encourage the health of the baby, so breastfeeding is, is that method, um, and just that comfort. So you're going to have a happier employee and happier baby. According to Essential Health, mothers are the fastest growing segment of the U.S. labor force, and approximately 70% of employed mothers with children aged three or younger work full time. Reporting in Brainerd, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. Essential Health St. Joseph's Medical Center in Brainerd is one of only nine hospitals in Minnesota designated as baby friendly. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.